you can observe this particular question uh, what is the information they have given see a sender you just stop and wait a r q okay stop and wait a r q for the reliable transmission of the frames so you know very well in the case of stop and wait a r q you will send only one frame so based on that the window size you can try only one frame is allowed you send one frame stop and wait for the acknowledgement so they have used a word called a r q so that if any retransmissions are there you can apply that one if it is lost that is the meaning of automatic repeat request so you can see frame size is given in this problem frame size is given okay it is how many bytes so it is how many bytes it is 1000 bytes and the transmission rate at the sender see now you see so they have not given the uh, band they have given the transmission rate so that means what it is sending at that rate means using the utilized bandwidth only it is going to transmit okay so transmission rate will be less than or equal to the bandwidth so that you can utilize okay yeah so transmission rate of sender they have given and so don't think that always they will give a bandwidth okay sometimes they can give the transmission rate also because noise will be there some losses will be there all this taken into consider the effective utilizer bandwidth is the transmission rate it is given as uh, 80 kilobits per second and they are also giving some information you can observe for the kilo na use 1000 they are saying okay kilobits per second use 1000 bits per second because sometimes kilo means 2 power 10 also you will use now that is why they are mentioning. Uh, and you can see size of the acknowledgement and you see the transmission rate of the receiver is given separately okay it is like this. So based on this first if you calculate the transmission time of the data if you calculate normally data size upon bandwidth now it is data size upon transmission rate. So data size is how much 1000 bytes now so convert into bits so it is 1000 into 8 bits transmission rate is how much 80 into kilo means what 10 power 3 bits per second okay like that so 1000 bytes they have given a frame size huh. so if you calculate this 1000 1000 will cancel so 1 by 10 1 by 10 means what this is 0 0.1 second you can say 0 0.1 second transmission time of the data huh. now you can see in this problem they have given the acknowledgement now so now you can calculate transmission time of acknowledgement okay acknowledgement size of the transmission rate of the receiver transmission rate of the receiver that means from the other side the rate is what somewhat different actually it depends on the receiver capacity also now yes what is the acknowledgement size given you can see 100 bytes so convert into bits 100 into 8 bits yeah divided by the transmission rate at the receiver is how much 8 kilobits per second so 8 into 10 power 3 okay bits per second so if you calculate so 8 and 8 will cancel okay uh, so what is this value 1 by 10 second you can say 1 by 10 second like this or 0 0.1 second okay so both the transmission times you have calculated now you see propagation time is given as in the milliseconds that means the journey is given as propagation time is given as what 100 milliseconds so since it is given in milli now uh, try to convert into because those are already seconds now so try to convert this is how much 0 0.1 second you can see 0 0.1 second Huh. now you can see assuming that no frame is lost that means what here in the arq there are no retransmissions everything is reached safely 
Ah, now they are asking the sender throughput. You can say so simple this question sender throughput. Basically, if they ask a utilization on the numerator, you will get a time. But now they are asking throughput means what data size numerator data size. That means how much data you transmit in a specified time. What is the specified time? It is so simple na transmission time of the data plus propagation time of the data. Plus uh, transmission time of acknowledgement. If it is given, yes, it is given in the problem. We have done it. Okay. If it is not given, no need to take. Okay. Then propagation time of what acknowledgement. So this is the sender throughput. You can say. So if you substitute all the parameters, okay, from the given problem, it will be like this. Yeah. So what is the data size means? What frame size na? So it is a thousand. Bytes na so into eight okay bits. Uh, what is the transmission time of data? Here you have calculated na zero point one seconds plus propagation time of data that is given as zero point one seconds that we have converted. Okay, transmission time we acknowledge how much zero point one seconds and propagation time of acknowledgement how much zero point one seconds. So if I substitute the entire value, nothing but what thousand into eight bits, okay, divided by zero point one, okay, four times now, so zero point four actually seconds. Hmm. So if you do this uh, calculations, so how much you are going to get? So thousand, okay, into eight. But here you see they are asking in the bytes per second. So if they are asking in bytes means you can keep this, you can remove this eight. Okay, you can remove this eight and you can use the okay bytes actually because they are asking bytes now. So you can take the bytes as the units. So bytes per second, thousand by how much it is zero point four, or this is ten thousand. Okay, by four you can say. So this value is two. Okay, five double zero bytes per second. Okay, so this is the final answer you can say. Okay.